Hi, Steven here from Core Electronics. In this video, I'm going to show you how to assemble your visa mount for the Raspberry Pi. The visa mount allows you to mount any Raspberry Pi Model B, A, or Zero onto the back of any visa compatible television or display or computer monitor. And it's also compatible with any of our slim cases. So the visa mount comes with a single acrylic panel. It will be covered in protective paper and a little, little bag of parts that includes spacers and hardware and rubber feet to attach your board. So the first step that we are going to take is removing the paper from the visa mount using the paper peeler that comes in the kit. This helps you get the paper started and save your fingernails and not scratch the board. Um, we're just gonna peel the paper away. So you'll notice once you get the layer off the back that there's gonna be some stubborn pieces in the letters and writing on the board. We're just gonna take the edge of our paper peeler and drag them across the letters and that will get those last stubborn pieces of paper without, without scratching the acrylic. Um, you may, it may make some smudges that you'll need to wipe away. Either just rub those away with your finger or use a dry, lint-free cloth to get those. Don't ever clean acrylic with any sort of detergent or isopropyl alcohol as it will um, it'll weaken the material. So there we have it. We have our visa mount ready to go. The first step is to take our rubber feet and adhere them to the back. I like to put them just inside of each of the, the small diameter holes. The visa mount fits both 75 millimeter and 100 millimeter square visa mounts. Next, we're going to attach our Raspberry Pi. So each board that you choose, it has a layout for where they would fit on the board itself. Underneath each of the, underneath each of the bolts, we're going to put a spacer. So there's two different types of spacers included in the kit. There's spacers for, for the mounts for the TV, the Visa mounts themselves, the thumb screws, and then there's there's spacers for the bolts that hold the Raspberry Pi. So under each of the under each of the four bolt holes for the Pi, I'm just removing the centers that might have been left in the spacers. I'm going to break off the spacers from the little holder, put them in place. You can peel the paper off these too if you like, and I'll feed in my nylon screws that will hold the board in place. Holding the nut from the bottom, I will then screw the nylon screw into the nut on the bottom. There's no need to make these very tight, just snug is all you need. Now our board is firmly attached. Notice that the HDMI port points down um, in comparison to the writing. Uh, it's better to have the port and the power going down instead of up, but you know, every television or display is different, so just rot them whatever in whatever way is most suitable for your application. The nylon bolts will stick out beyond the bottom of the board a little bit, so if you have some flush cut um, pliers, this would be, you could trim those off, or you could always come up from the bottom with the nylon bolts so the excess sticks out the top, so the visa plate will continue to sit on its rubber feet. Um, it's really up to you there. And finally, we'll mount this on our display using the thumb screws included, one at each corner, or just two if you like. And there's spacers in the kit as well, and these will allow you to 
um, will you allow you to mount those thumb screws if you need a little bit, a um, little bit more clearance. There you have it, the Visa mount for the Raspberry Pi. Now you're ready to stick this on the back of a monitor or display and uh, get your media center running. Uh, there's one other thing that we can do with the Visa mount, and that is it, it is compatible with any um, slim case that we make. Slim case for Raspberry Pi, 3V plus, zero, or A plus. And the Visa plate's just a direct replacement for the back panel. So the board will fit right in place in the case, so it's still protected. So I have an A, um, an A plus case here that I've taken the bottom panel of the case off. The A plus just sits in place on the Visa mount. You can take those same nuts from that come with the Visa with the slim case, put them in place through the Visa mount, and there you have it. You have your Pi in its case mounted onto the Visa mount to keep it safe from fingers or stray wires and still hold it onto the back of your monitor. That sums up how to assemble the Visa mount for the Raspberry Pi. Thanks for watching.